All right, so he was eating. I was decided to leave with my pills one just so I can get up some rocks straight away in the match, which is really nice. So uh, he actually missed the world the first time, which is really, really good for me because now this thing uh, can actually do some damage to stuff later on down the line. So I decided to go into this, this guy to take a, uh, take a burn because he really doesn't mind being burned. I just go for the size, I was trying to do as much damage as possible. I know this thing won't be able to touch me because I'm especially defensive, so yeah, that's always good. And I decided to go for the wish just in case he wanted to switch out or something, but you just go for the pain split, which is really annoying, but it doesn't really matter too much. And now I know he really can't do anything to my Ludicolo, so I decided to go into Ludicolo, pass the wish onto that, get a load of uh, health back, get back to full health, and now I can just for a surf because I am modest life orb and that will do a lot of damage for wheezing but he goes out into his mill tank which doesn't take this that well but it's not quite a two hit KO as we'll discover in a second because I do prefer another one and he does live with the smidgen and just go for the milk drink and get his health all the way back up and I know he's probably going to want to go for the um for the thunder wave or the body slam right now so I just decide to go out into my vacuum again and I take that thunder wave really nicely and now I can just hit this thing hard with an earthquake because I do pack the uh, adamant max attack earthquake which is stab and all that sort of stuff but it doesn't do that much but I know he really can't do anything to me so I know he's going to want to switch out and I decide to go in for the ice wall crash predicting the switch into Charizard and that does work out because he goes into his Jarazan and just dies to a social crash, so that's really nice. Now he goes out into this thing, and I just decide to go uh, into my Ludicolo. I think he might be able to live a hyper voice, but I don't do that very well at all. I decide to go with the Geek Drone try and get a little bit of health back, do a little damage to this thing at the same time, but doesn't quite manage to kill it, and he does manage to kill me with hyper voice. So I decide to go into my specially defensive Hypno and just try and take as many hits as I possibly could, so uh, before he tried to kill me, and I just try to wish uh, Protect stall him down. But this really isn't working out for me, as you can probably tell. It's, it goes off quite a few turns me trying to stall this thing out because I just I I was deciding to do do I. Stall that half voice or do I not? Do I do I not? Do I do or not? No, no, no. I decided in the end, no, probably not best idea. Probably best to uh, sack this thing after going for a seismic toss as much damage as possible. Go into my scarf stalk and kill this thing off then. But as you can see, this thing is still going on. But yeah, this is basically my thought process. I just explained to you in really fast motion because that's what I have to do because it's fast motion Friday. So yeah, um, I believe it's right about here that I uh, decided to just die. No, I think it, yeah, maybe. No, no, I can't remember. Oh my god. Okay, yeah, it is. I decided to go for the seismic toss here. I knew I'd die for another one, but it really doesn't matter. I can go for into my scarf stalk in a second just for revenge killer. But I knew he'd probably want to switch out so I decided to go into the, for the earthquake but I guess he wanted to see what I'd lock myself into so he decided to stay on with a good play. Now he goes into this guy. I do have a mole breaker but I really don't want to take a hit because I'm pretty sure this thing can live so I decided to go into this guy, take a take the obvious will of us and now I'll go for the sludge bomb and now he goes for the will of us again and that's really nice because now he won't I know he won't go for another will of us so I decided to go into my scum tank because scum tank can just torment this thing and do whatever and so and probably take any special hit as well because the uh, sludge bomb won't do anything the fire blast doesn't do much so I decided to go for the taunt but it turns out to have the hidden power ground which is very annoying because uh, basically it hurts my scum tank quite a lot but now he's taunted it I know I can just go right into my sork and because you can't burn any and um, fire blast and whatever it won't do that much so yeah um, so I just decided to go straight for the earthquake and it does uh, quite a bit to this mill tank so I do get a critical hit so that means I'm two hit KO apparently easily so that's really nice because that, that thing is now dead because it's a stupid cow and it was annoying but yeah that thing is dead and now he goes into this guy I really don't want to have to um no no I, I predicted him to um, over predict and just go for the like uh, for the fire blast or the uh, sludge bomb or something so I just decided to stay in and just go for two earthquakes and that thing that works out because that thing dies and now I'd, um, he goes into this thing and I knew, I knew it wouldn't be able to one hit okay and so I decided to go into my pillars one, sack that because I knew the close combat would be able to kill to do as much damage to this thing as possible with ice shard and poison racking up and all that sort of good stuff. So yeah, um, and now I just decided to go to my sword because I know I can live a quick attack from this range. But it turns out he gets a critical hit on this quick attack, which is very very annoying because now yeah. So uh, I decided to go into this guy and go for the sucker punch, but he um, knows that how that works, so he just goes for a quick attack. So that's really annoying because now I'm gonna have to go into the uh, go into my. Go, go into my wheezing, take take a few hits with this thing and, and let this uh, boner die, so yeah, and now uh, he goes into his last guy who is his uh, go lurk, and I decided to, I didn't think about going for the will o -Wisp because I thought um, he wouldn't have anything to hit me with, but it turns out he does, so yeah um, and he just kills me off two shadow punches and now I can just go into my scum tank, hopefully give him off with a sucker punch and that'll be near the game, so I hope you guys enjoyed thanks very much for being, see you next time